Mr. Chairman, I'd like to make a motion that the board authorize the chairman to sign a contract with the superintendent for the current 2020-2021 school year and accept his letter of resignation effective June 30th, 2021. Is there a second to Mr. Hatfield's motion? Chris Champagne. Okay, seconded by Chris. Any discussion needed? Mr. Chairman, I would like to just offer my sincere thank you to Mr. Wilson for his time in leadership, uh, leading our district in the last four years and wish him well on his future endeavors and look forward to the next couple months working with him. Okay. Through the chair. Thank you. Anyone else? Okay, I would also like as the board chair to thank uh, Mr. Wilson for his service to the Seymour community, the Seymour students, Seymour teachers, Seymour administrators. And I know I got the order all different ways, but I appreciate your professionalism during that time. And I wish you your good luck in your future educational career, unless you're changing career, but that's not my business to ask you. Mr. Chairman, Fred Stanek, if I may comment also. Yes, you may. I too would like to thank Mr. Wilson for his of the past year. I know that this has not been easy. There's been times when I'm sure Mr. Wilson has not has questioned himself as to whether he was making the right decision. No one has known exactly how to proceed during this terrible crisis of the COVID-19 infection during the past year. I think Mr. Wilson has handled the COVID situation and the structure of the school district during the situation in an exemplary manner. And his team has done a great job. I've been disturbed by some of the comments that have been made by the public about the way the school district has handled the situation. As I said, there's been no right answer or wrong answer. I think we have strived and Mr. Wilson has led the team to strive toward keeping our children and our staff and our community as safe as possible and healthy as possible during this crisis. Mr. Wilson, I thank you not only for that, but for your service. Any, anyone else? Yes, Mr. Kubik. I would, I would also like to thank Michael for his four years of service and echo most of what his comments. Um, it, this last year has been a very difficult year. Um, I'm not sure that anyone can make a right or wrong decision as we see by public comments and on a variety of meetings in the emails that we received. There's a significant amount of people that believe the kids should be in school and there's a, uh, another group that feels the kids should not be in school. Um, it's not an easy call. I'm uh, fortunately my children are not in school so um, it, it would be tough as a parent and I'm sure it's it's got to be very difficult as a superintendent and uh, his entire administration to sit around a table and try to make those decisions in the best interest of the students, teachers, faculty, parents, taxpayers, and everything else. So thank you, Michael. Thanks for everything you've done and your administration too. Thank you. Okay, any other board member wishing to uh, comment at this particular time? Okay, 